Hey guys, what's going on? It's Scott from Fly Rides. I'm back today with another two minute tip for you. A very simple thing that you can do to keep yourself out of the shop and riding for longer without coming in with uh, silly little things that you don't need to be coming into the shop for. I'm gonna send you over to Hector. He's gonna be standing right where I'm standing right now. Hector, take it away. Hey guys, Hector here, and I'm here to save you guys some time, probably some headaches and some money. So the number one issue that we get is uh, when it comes to drivetrains, people having issues on I'm not getting enough power or I'm not seeing how fast I'm going on my display is one thing and it's simply checking the magnet. So we're here to just do a quick two minute tip on how to troubleshoot uh, your magnet and your speed sensor. So step one, it's checking your magnet that's most likely located on the spoke and make sure that it's nice and tight. If it's moving around, that means that it's not correctly uh, giving enough feedback to the sensor, meaning that you're not going to get enough power and you're not going to get a correct speed, uh, speed reading on your display. Step number two, loosen the speed uh, magnet on your spoke. That way you can freely move it up and down the spoke and not damage the actual spoke. Some spokes are bladed, so be careful on that as well. And then step three, on Bosch, and other speed sensors, there's a nice little slit behind the sensor that you could align the magnet to. Once you get it nice and aligned, you wanna hold it there, make sure you're not gonna scratch your frame while you re-tighten that magnet straight onto the spoke. Lastly, check to make sure that once it's fully done, do a couple rotations so you can see that on your speed it's accurately reading and that you're actually getting power. So that's our two minute tip for the day guys. Like this video, subscribe to this channel so that you can stay up to date on e-bike news and also uh, tips and tricks that's going to keep you again riding without coming into a shop. Uh, leave a comment below. Let us know what you guys want to know about on your bike so we can serve you better. All right, we'll see you guys next time.